everybody and welcome to Boston, Massachusetts. Today I'm taking a walk down the Boston waterfront as we get close to sunset here. Let's see, it's a beautiful day. Today is Monday, June 11th, 20, sorry, Monday, July 11th, 2022. And let's see what the temperature is. Uh, 77 degrees out. It's cooled off quite a bit. We were in the mid 80s today. Looks like the aquarium whale watch boat is. I doubt they're heading out on a. Oh, there's people on it. Maybe they're looking right now. Seems kind of late in the day. You can see there's still some sun hitting the water. I think sunsets in about 45 minutes or so. We've just had beautiful day after beautiful day after beautiful day lately. Statues here, or the uh, sculptures. Tell me how to make it not hurt. Super windy here, but I think I'm protected uh, by the buildings back here. Just right around the corner, it's really the winds are really gusting hard today. You get back down on the cobblestone here, or the bricks. You can see the Tobin Bridge in the distance there. Looks like they might be, in fact, heading out for a whale watch on that New England Aquarium boat. So sorry, I haven't done a live stream in quite some time. I'm always going in between uh, doing a live stream, and which is a lot lower quality than just recording at 4K 60 with no stutters or anything, and then uploading later. But it's kind of nice to get the scene as it's happening. fire going here, the fire pit. So 
This is quite a ship here. The podium and from Georgetown. As usual, when I go by here, I'll go up the stairs here. We get the aerial view. I don't think I mentioned the time. It is currently 7.38 p.m. It's just a gorgeous early evening, late afternoon. Decent sized boat there. Head back down and go around, maybe down to Seaport Boulevard. You can see the sun is setting behind the skyline there. This is the 1876 historic edge of Pier 2. Oh Ray, it's a it's a beautiful, beautiful evening right now. The weather couldn't be better. I mentioned before we've just had mid 70s to low 80s and just sunny days pretty much all summer so far. Not many really hot days. I love the smell of the uh, ocean here. There's the ICA. Should probably walk along the water here.
We're right across from the ICA now. Completely protected from the wind back here. You see the, the water is pretty still. See, maybe I'll see if I can walk around this way. As always, if you enjoy this content, uh, make sure to hit the like button. If you want to see content like this going forward and you're not subscribed, make sure to hit the subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. Looks like there's a cut through here if you wanted. There's a plane taking off in the distance. We're basically right across from Logan Airport over here. Across the harbor. Yeah, I'm just gonna cut up here on the grass. Oh yeah, there. See the plane through the buildings. here to Sorel Bakery and Cafe. Looks like they're closed right now. This is Northern Ave. Clear. I think I'm going to cut up a block first and then I'm going to go over to Seaport Boulevard. Sounds like a chainsaw is going crazy. Maybe. Doing some work over there. I don't think that's a chainsaw. It's like some kind of uh, high pressure uh, tool. Approaching Seaport Boulevard now. See the good views of the Boston skyline here. You can see they have all these sculptures here. 
here, but they have a few of them down the street here. It's pretty quiet now on a weekend. Uh, it's pretty hopping in this area usually. There's a seaport sign on the uh, light po post there. What I'll do is I'll walk back down across back over the bridge to uh, Atlantic Ave. Some little shops here. It's looking pretty closed right now though. I should do this again on a really hopping uh, weekend night. In the middle of the summer, it should be pretty good. Oh yeah, there's another uh, sculpture down here. I think it's a squirrel. I think I just saw an electric bike fly by. I think I'm eventually going to get either an electric bike or an electric scooter. They look like a lot of fun. Could also do videos from those. Yeah, there's a, see the squirrel, it's like holding a bird or something. Hopefully you can see that, the fish eye. It's like a dove or something on this one. It's a bird of some kind. bird sculpture in front of the FedEx truck. camera and oh yeah the weather's been incredible honestly I can't think of a better start to the summer than this year I mean if you enjoy mild weather and that you know hot weather is nice too because it's you can go cool off at the beach a little more but man this it's the weather's been so comfortable so far this year oh, it looks like an eagle on this corner Looks like it's holding a bottle or something. This one's a face with a little bird in the up in the hair. All right, so we're getting close. We'll cross the uh, Seaport Bridge. It's a Tuscan kitchen. And every single uh, tourist destination needs to have a Sephora. And that's great. I love I love Revere Beach. It's a great resource to have it. I used to go through it there every day, like I'd have to stop and take photos on a daily basis because I don't know what it is. The sky is always just looks so beautiful there. Somehow it's like more blue or the sunset's more vibrant. It's probably in my head, but it is it's a gorgeous beach, I think.
Java 58, yes, I am in the Seaport District. I think this is the first four final sculpture over here. Looks like the top of a pineapple. Here we go, we got the walk. So we're going to cross the bridge here over to Atlantic Ave. You can see we're going to go by the famous Barking Crab. Very popular restaurant, seafood restaurant here. And personally, I'm not a huge seafood fan, so I don't eat here, but uh, a lot of people who like seafood they definitely eat here. I know it's weird, I live in New England and I'm not crazy about seafood. Best shucking deck in Boston. You can see it's pretty busy right now. I'm basically shooting where that ship is, is basically where I started this walk. I basically just went in a big loop. cameras definitely it's just fun to kind of walk around and just kind of suss out an area there's a lot of little nooks and crannies in Boston and to be honest there's there's a lot of great stuff around Boston too like the South Shore the North Shore we know like we like we here to uh, Rockport yeah there's just a lot of be beautiful uh, places around there's Boston Harbor sun's pretty much going down at this point There's the old Northern Ave Bridge. Hasn't been used in a long time. This used to be, I, I think I mentioned before, but this used to be a great photographic uh, element to have because it used to light up in uh, different colors at night, but it doesn't anymore. Oh, there we go. We got some rowers going through. Nice. It's a little more, it's a little windier up here. the James Hook Lobster building. And I think this is Two International Place, the tall uh, cylindrical building. And Independence Wharf is to the right, which is 470 Atlantic Ave. back out here. A little bit of sun in the harbor still, a tiny bit. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit of a sunset on the other side going. Uh, the sky is kind of turning into that pink gradient. And we're almost down to Atlantic Ave. We're gonna come around to the James Hook Company, which is a lobster company. JamesHookLobster.com. So you can see the financial district straight ahead and government centers to the right. reposition my camera. There we go. All 
right? And here we are on Atlantic Ave. Guess I can walk down here a little bit. Yeah, here's the James Hook Lobster uh, front. Looks like they have a little food truck outside. I'm going to continue down the waterfront. Maybe we can catch a little bit more sunset. Oh, the moon is rising. It looks nearly full. Unfortunately, my camera probably doesn't really show it that well because it's a fisheye. So this will basically just cut us back down along the waterfront. And then maybe what I'll do is I'll go back to Atlantic Ave through uh, the Boston Harbor Hotel Arch. Used to be able to walk straight across this bridge to the other side. Another plane taking off. We basically started off on it where that ship is right on the other side of the harbor. Or the channel, I guess. I think this is technically the four point channel. Right here. down on Rose Wharf now. There's a Rose Wharf water taxi. Sometimes they have entertainment on this blue stage there that says Summer in the City. If I recall, on Thursday nights they usually have entertainment. Could be any night, I'm sure. But I think at one point, it, every Thursday, they had something. Okay, I'm going to head back out to Atlantic Ave. Here's the huge flag. Subject of many photographs. Go see if the water fountain's on. to walk this uh, almost daily for a while and yeah, yeah I'll just never get I'll never grow tired of it same thing as along the Charles River too there's a few there's a lot actually Oscar Beach unfortunately most things are closed now because it's a it's a Monday there's a custom house clock tower. 
Oh yeah, there's... You can walk back down. Pretty much there's a whole bunch of places to get onto the harbor walkway. Okay, we're pretty far down Atlantic. We're actually getting down close to like Christopher Columbus Park and Faneuil Hall now. <laughs> oh yeah, it looks like the fountain's running. <laughs> I guess I could have walked down the waterfront a little further. Maybe I can. I think I can cross here. There's a granary tavern across the street. I'll hit the Wait. I always do this. I'm not sure exactly where in the life cycle it is. So. Oh, I can go. Okay, I'm fine. The uh, thumb just stopped. Hopefully, it'll fire up while I'm walking here. <laughs> This is kind of a great central spot around these buildings. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> I should just run through there right now. That's no, alright. I don't think I want to get soaking wet. <laughs> This is a beautiful spot in Boston for sure. Uh, maybe what I'll do, I'll just walk down to Christopher Columbus Park. Since it's just a little further.
up Atlantic Ave. State Street Provisions. Here's the aquarium tea stop. Um. is on the water. That always seems to be really busy. And we can see a little bit more of the waterfront. I think we still have a little bit of a sunset left. There's some Boston shirts, Wicked Smart, some Harvard stuff. Uh, if there's any uh, particular places you'd like to see me live stream at, let me know. I'm just kind of winging it today. I just happened to be in Boston. Looks like the stream's held up pretty decently today. Not too much choppiness as far as I noticed. Trying to keep it at 1080p. Oh yeah, here's the trellis back here. Maybe what I'll do is walk around and go back up to the trellis. Oh, I'm probably gonna get copyright claimed because of the music playing down here. <laughs> so I'll try to talk over it. <laughs> Yeah, there's a little bit of the uh, color in the sky still. vibe down here is amazing right now, I have to say. I love it. It's not too busy, but there's a lot of people out having fun, enjoying the weather. You gotta love it. Here's Joe's down here. Okay, I'm a getting a little dark on my feed. <laughs> See the moon rising up over there. It's a Long Wharf Marriott, that red bi first big brick red building with the uh, levels on it. Okay, I guess I'll take a walk through the trellis here. This is another great angle of the custom house here, the clock tower.
Ooh, nice throw. It's a good chuck. Look at that football. Visit the dentist. According to that writing on the ground. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to end it around here. Um, I really appreciate you for coming along on this walk. I hope you enjoyed it. I can tell you it was one of the most, it was just an incredibly beautiful evening. Um, as always, make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it. Uh, if you like my content overall and you're not subscribed, make sure to hit the subscribe button. Every subscription helps. Um, I check out my photography at wayneoxfordphotography.com. I have stuff from a lot of parts of New England, just not Boston, uh, not just Boston. Uh, and as always, I'll see you next time. Bye. Oh, it takes me a minute to remember how to shut this down. I think.